Students at several local high schools are learning skills that will last a lifetime, of course, through an innovative education model called 3DE. The nationwide program is designed to help get them ready for whatever is next. And it's taking college and career readiness to a whole new level. Just ask these Northside High School students who are national champs. We want to welcome you to our 9.4 Arby's Case Challenge presentation. I'm Kyler Cooney. I'm Kara Conley. I'm Madison Sherratt. I'm Zan Gunawardena. And I'm Eric McCann. And this is our app, Rodeo Award. These freshmen at Northside High School, who were virtual strangers just a few months ago, are now national champions. <laughs> Six weeks of brainstorming and planning culminated in this presentation, oh part of Junior Achievement's 3DE. It brings schools, business leaders, and students together to teach skills that are essential in today's workforce. Here's how it works. Each group is given a case challenge, a problem that a partnering business is trying to solve. We were trying to figure out how to attract younger teens to go to Arby's, visit Arby's, and be invested in the Arby's business. The five students on this team did research, tossed around ideas, and ultimately came up with a potential solution. Arby's needs to speak to us in a platform we can, we can connect with in a language that we can understand. Our solution was an an in-app game called Rodeo Rewards where you can unlock different levels and different games to basically earn rewards and coupons for Arby's. For Arby's. Along the way, they learned how to effectively communicate, collaborate, and think critically, three of the pillars of 3DE. Chosen as a finalist at Northside, the group then got to compete on a national level. Pat Morello, the market lead for 3DE by JA, says he's continually impressed by the ingenuity of students. But these five years young adults came up with a solution that I will tell you product managers across the country would not have come up with. Then the day the students, their parents, teachers and administrators had been waiting for. And this year's champions are Northside High School. <laughs> Since implementing 3DE at Northside, school officials say they've seen tremendous growth among students from improved attendance and better grades to more classroom engagement. These soft skills that students are learning through 3DE are things that they're going to use today, tomorrow, and in their inevitable future, and it is helping them be ready for that day that they graduate, stepping into whatever field career or venture that they go into. To watch the, the not only the year over year, but the case by case growth of the confidence going from like very little to off the charts confident, that to me has been amazing. The five students agree, saying the case challenge taught them how to overcome reservations about public speaking and how to persevere when challenged. I felt so like happy and relieved that all our hard work and late nights paid off. This past year, students at Northside and Snyder took part in 3DE, and in the fall, it's expanding to Wayne, Northrop, and Southside. Bravo. Yes. I mean, those five futures right there are so bright. And what a compliment to say that people working in this field, adults, mm -hmm. full-time, being paid probably very well, wouldn't have even come up with an idea that those five young people did. You know, I think it's because they're just not afraid to dream and brainstorm for it. And, and have those ideas and then see it through to fruition. So it's, it's really exciting and it's a really great innovative education model that, that all students are going to benefit from. Yeah, and the best yeah. part is meeting those young people oh, absolutely. through your story. Yeah, they were so great. Love it.